For cheap, safe, and reliable coins, head on over to FIFACoinZone.com. Use Dirty at checkout, 15% off, and hold up. We've also got codes, cheap games, all of the above, G2A.com, everything in the description. Dirty at checkout gets you that extra discount tip. What's happening, beautiful people? My name is Dirty Mike, and welcome to the Top 5 BBVA Team of the Season. Woo! If you enjoy the content, you want to see some more Razzle Dazzle, I think we got the League of One coming next week. Drop a thumbs up. Also, subscribe if you're new, and I want to see your opinion. Hit me with some comments. Who's in your top five? What is looking like? And eh, we're going to have some debatables. You can count on that. Let's roll. Booming and zooming into the honorable mentions, we've got James Rodriguez. Woo! And he's got informs all over the place this year. Deserve the card. Fantastic. Just lovely. Center attacking midfielder, especially in the 4 triple two. Uh, we also have Marcelo, the left back. I talked about him with the most consistent. A player that's got to be in a lot of different squads. He doesn't have any weaknesses. It's just such a competitive league. It was hard to get him into the top five. And then Otamendi, which might be the most affordable of any on the countdown. Great value pickup. If you need a good center back, that's going to give you consistency. And he's very physical. And he is not missing any sorts of challenges. Any 50-50 and you're going to be in a good situation. At number five, we've got Lionel Messi. And I know this might be a surprise to some folks. But I just like his other cards better. Mainly because of the positioning. Uh, having him in a central role is much better than out there on the wing. He can get forgotten. Even though the card is talented, I've got to use it a little bit on the PlayStation. <sighs> Just missing something for me. And I think there's better players in the BVA in terms of being able to influence matches with this team of the season. Born and scoring, we've got Neymar, who's got the skills to pay the bills. Five star, we put five stars, skill moves, and he's Brazilian. Easy to link up, 98 pace, 99 dribbling, 94 shooting. We can keep going. And he's got one of the most proficient finesse shots from outside the box, in my opinion, in this year's installment. Both feet, I love it. I love this card. Don't mind that he's on the wing at all, because he can kind of wiggle and work. And the way that he coasts past the opposition. Ooh, ooh. At the midway point, we've got the Frenchman. Yes, sir. He is coming in above Neymar, Griezmann, and this is the only version of his card that actually finishes a little bit above Neymar for me, and I'm not sure what it is. He's just got that special delivery. I'm scoring goals with his right foot, his left foot. We're wiggling, we're working. We got the dancing and the prancing. Another guy that's got cool hair. I got to really step my game up, but I needed to put him at number three. I wouldn't be doing him a service, doing him a justice if I didn't have him pretty high up in the countdown because I performed so well. I'll probably put him into some squads on stream, Twitch TV forward slash Dirty Mike if you want to check that out Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Plug. Plug. At the runner-up spot, we've got Suarex, and I don't have anything negative to say about this card. He's a 96 overall. His shooting is impeccable. His passing, hey, no problem. 94 physical. 94 physical on a Suarez card, and now he's quick. He's fast. He can actually burst by the opponent and never be caught. That was the only downfall in his normal card. He had a good little sidestep and he could finish, but he did not have that sprint speed to just let him outpace every center back, every fullback, but he's got that now and it's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. If you have the coinage, grab him. Top in the charts, we've got team of the season, Ronaldo, and if he fits the criteria of my countdown, he's always in the top two or three players, whether it's gonna be a free kick taker, a skill move artist, just the best overall players in the game, and this is no different. I, I highly recommend uh, picking up either a Team of the Season Ronaldo, a regular Ronaldo, in four, man of the match, whatever you can afford, record breaker, there's so many different versions of Ronaldo in this installment, but he makes a difference in every single game of FIFA, whether you are great at the game, terrible at the game, or somewhere in between, you run, you sprint, you're whipping crosses, or you do a lot of skill moves, you have the total package, He's going to make you better. Every time I play against Ronaldo, he causes problems. Whether my opponent is, you know, through the roof, he's just pushing boundaries in FIFA, or he's just, eh. But if you enjoyed the content, make sure to drop a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you're new, and follow me on Twitter and Facebook at DirtyMikeUSA. I have a lot more coming your way ASAP, ASAP. Peace.